Last week, researchers from Isle Royale released their annual wolf moose study, and the news is grim for the wolf population. ABC 10's Keweenaw Bureau reporter Sam Ali spoke with two of the top researchers to get the details on one of the longest research project studies in the world. In its 56th year, the Isle Royale Wolf Moose Study looks at the relationship between two of the more prominent species on the island, and researchers from Michigan Tech say that over the past three years, they have tallied the lowest number of wolves ever. And all we know that's happened is wolves left the island <laughs> uh, because they're interested in, in breeding and having pups and reproducing in their own pack, and the wolves that are there now don't find the kinds of breeding opportunities they want. Dr. Rolf Peterson added that one of the bigger problems also is wolf predation, which is the proportion of the moose population killed by wolves. As a matter of fact, Peterson says it's at its lowest level ever recorded. So wolves, in particular wolf predation, is, is pretty much gone already, even though there's wolves there. So with wolf predation not having much of an effect on moose, the moose themselves are increasing pretty rapidly. John Vucetich, who is the director of the study, added that the harsh weather conditions also had an effect on the dwindling wolf population. So on Isle Royal, where there are moose, uh, it's important that not only that there be wolves, but those wolves be in healthy enough condition uh, that they are, are keeping moose under control. Inbreeding has also been a problem, and ice bridges bringing in new wolves has helped, but they have become less common than in the past. So why not just bring over some wolves from the UP onto the island? If a person were comfortable with the idea that uh, protecting Isle Royale's ecosystem health really is the most important objective to have in mind, if that's the goal, it would be relatively straightforward to, uh, to, to uh, promote that goal and to make sure that goal came about by just bringing a couple of wolves to Isle Royale. The idea does seem to make sense in the short term. However, Isle Royal officials say as long as there is a breeding population of wolves on the island, no intervention will take place. For ABC 10 CW5 News Now, I'm Sam Ali.